Hey everybody, it's Tristan from World English School, and today I want to read uh, uh, my favorite book, one of my favorite books, called Animalia. And I think his name is Graham. I think that's pronounced Graham Base. And I love this book. I used to read this book as a kid. I didn't own it, but um, I checked it out from the library a lot of times, I think. So I want to show it to you today. Now the fun thing about this book is in every picture, I don't know if I can see it here, Maybe not in this picture, but... Oh no, I'm right. There it is. Um, a little boy is in every picture, and on every page, I think on every letter, it's like an alphabet book. You can see this little boy. It's kind of like, uh, Where's Waldo? So, let's, uh, let's take a look. Oh, here it says right here. Within the pages of this book, you may discover, if you look, Beyond the spell of written words, a hidden land of beasts and birds. For many things are of a kind, and those with keenest eyes will find a thousand things, or maybe more. It's up to you to keep the score. A final word before we go. There's one more thing you ought to know. In Animalia, you see, it's possible you might find me, <laughs> Graham. He wrote this book for Robin. This was 1986. I was four years old at that time. I was born in 82. Well, one more thing I want to show you before I start is the cover here is got, uh, look at this, armadillo, butterfly, cat, boar, elephant, frog, gorilla. It's A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Isn't that right? Yeah, that's right, yeah. Who's that? H? Hockey? Maybe? H-I-J-K. Yeah, all the way around to Z. That's cool. I like that. Okay, let's start the book. So we're looking for this boy on each page. Alright. You know, when I was a kid, I never read this, uh, but... Yeah, I'll read it. Why not? Mm -hmm. An armored armadillo avoiding an angry alligator. So they're all A words. A-A-A-A-A-A-A. Every single word. Check that out. Look, this alligator's wearing a bib. <laughs> or a, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, a bib. And then here's more A words. Adam, brand, anchovies. And then you've got all sorts of A words here. An ape. Um, Peter Pan. Act acting, I guess? Acrobats, maybe? Archbishop. <laughs> Africa, looks like. Admiral. Athletics and artists. Wow, there's all sorts of A sounds. And an asp, snake, an ant, abacus, alien. It's a comet he's inside. Oh, look, check this out. Do you see the boy? I'm not going to show you where the boy is. Can you see him? He's in this view somewhere. Where is he now? Here's an accordion, armadillo, an armored armadillo. And then the alligator is here. Oh, and there's one more thing. Look, an anchor. Huh. Man, a lot of A sounds. Look, there's more stuff. An ambulance and an archer and an alarm clock, an apple. What's this? I don't know what that is, actually. And then there's an acorn here. Oh, look, an antenna. Man, he's got all sorts of stuff in here. Can you believe it? Oh, I know what this is now. It's not a bib. It's an apron. <laughs> Why did I say bib? Oh, there's more stuff. Look. There's an antelope right here in the background, see? An anteater. And then you've got an albatross here. Wow. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a, uh, what's that dog called? I can't remember. There's a dog breed. And then look at here. There's a little boat. What's that? Noah's Ark. Nice. And then Allegra. It says music here. Man, arithmetic. Oh, Australia. Look at that. My goodness. Oh, an angel is here too. Look at that in the A. Jeez, there's a lot of stuff, isn't there? Did I miss anything? There's an ace down here. Holy moly. A lot of stuff. Okay, I think we got everything. I don't know. Can I finish this book? I'll read as much as I can. Next page. Beautiful blue butterflies basking by a babbling brook. 
What does babbling mean? It means like constant sound, doesn't it? All right, now can you tell me what these things are? I'll give you a second. Three, two, one. Bassoon. It's a bassoon. How about this? Holding the bassoon. Three, two, one. Baboon. What about this thing? That's a bonnet. That's a baby bonnet. But what is this thing? Barracuda. No, what is that? A bear? Oh, it's a bear. I guess it's a bear, isn't it? Yeah, okay. How about this? Three, two, one. Butterfly. This. Three, two, one. Beetle. Nice. And how about that? Three, two, one. Bee. That's an easy one, huh? There's more butterflies here. What's this in the background? There's a, uh... Ah, that might be a bungalow. <laughs> Boy, there's some difficult words in here. All right, there's a lot more bees in here. How about this? Three, two, one. Bull. A cow, a bull. How about this? This uh, Scottish instrument. Three, two, one. Bagpipes. And uh, does anybody know what that game is? I think. Three, two, one. Backgammon. I think it's called. And what's this? This is an easy one. Three. Two, one, bicycle. What else do we have here? Boy, there's all sorts of stuff. Look at this, all the way down here. Buttons. Man, alive. What else do we have here? I can't really see it very well. Bracelet, maybe? Barrel, there's a barrel. Wow, there's all sorts of stuff. Boy, I can't really see it, even... Even just uh, without the camera, it's hard to see. Boy, that's cool though, isn't it? A babbling brook. This is the babbling brook. The stream. Well, I like that picture. Okay. Oh, hey, where's the boy? Oh, is he... So is he in every picture? I don't know. I guess you'll have to get the book. <laughs> I don't know where he is. I guess he's only in every... On every page. But I don't see him here. I'm looking around too. I don't see him. Maybe uh, he. Oh, maybe he's in here somewhere, huh? Boy, I don't know where he is. Okay, next page. Wow, look at this. This is one big page of cats. It says, "Crafty crimson cats carefully catching crusty crayfish." <laughs> Crafty crimson cats carefully catching crusty crayfish. <laughs> these are crayfish, and these, of course, are cats, as you know. Okay, let's go quick, huh? Okay, I'm gonna point and I'll give you like a second. Cheese, cucumber, what is that? Oh, I don't know what that is. It's a spool, isn't it? And thread, but I don't know what's the C word. Gosh, I don't know, actually. Okay, what about that? Corn, how about that? Calculator, uh, cream pie, maybe? What's this? Candle? Coffee? Oh, look at that. A uh, canoe. Cabin? What about this? Chateau? <laughs> Man, these words are difficult. Hey, look back here. Camel. And? Cap. And? Ah, look on the cap. A cheetah. <laughs> and? This is a good one. Cactus. And? Concertina. Wow, these are hard words. Cow. And what's behind the cow? The boy. Look at that. There's the boy right there. And cage. And inside the cage. Canary. Camera. Cobra. Chicken. Man, alive. Oh, look down here. Crutch. What's this? An alarm clock. I don't know. Why is that a C word? I don't know. There's a cork. And here we have cornflakes. Clarinet comb, a can, a crab, oh look, I forgot this on the cream pie, there's uh, cherries, look at that, man, this book, oh look at this, do you know what that is, that's a hard one, well first of all, that's a giant clam, that's a clam, and that is a cog, C-O-G, boy, there's some tricky words in this book, did we see anything else in here, look, here's something, what's that? Coins. Ooh, look, there's more. Castle? Cemetery? What's this? Another castle? No, sorry. Church. 
And this is a castle, isn't it? And then look up here. Caterpillar. Oh, a chef or a cook. Calendar. Chimpanzee. Chevrolet. Or a car. Here's a crossword puzzle down here. And I got the chicken. Man, alive. What a great picture this is. I wonder how long it took him to, to make these pictures, huh? I can't see anything else. I think I got everything. Well, you know what? You know what I think this is? I saw that on the other page, too. I think that's his name. I'm not sure, though. Okay, let's move on. Did I miss anything? I bet you I... Oh, collar. Maybe a collar. Celery over here. I think that's some celery. Okay, let's move on. Wow, check this one out. There's a lot of light on this page. Diabolical dragons daintily devouring delicious delicacies. And he's got smoke coming out of here. Cool. Okay, so let's take a look. Let's go quickly on this one. Dragon, dictionary, date. Oh, dates. Those are dates. That fruit, isn't it? A duster, drawer. What's all this stuff? I can't. Dynamite? A drill? I don't know what that is. I really don't. Dice and dimes, maybe? And a drink? And a do. Oh, man, come on. Is that a dohecahedron? <laughs> I think so. A doll? Uh, dentures? Donuts? Look at all these donuts. Those look pretty good, don't they? What's this? I don't know what that's called. A flask, but I don't know what it is. Deluxe, it says dolphin dollar. What's this? Diamonds. What, what's that in? Cotton candy looks like. I don't know what that is. There's a dormouse. There's a dart. Here's a dagger. Wow, look at all that stuff. And then December. Oh, wow. Look at that. December 6th of June, 1944. You know what that's called? D-Day. That was an important day in uh, World War II. Wow. And this D on that platter. Here's a dwarf, maybe? And then, what else do we have? Deed, maybe? I don't know. Looks like the Ten Commandments. Dragonfly. There's another dragon. A dog. Dominoes. A dodo. That's an extinct bird. Here's a... Here's a, a robot. But why is that a D sound? I don't know. And then a donkey. And then a... Drowned. He drowned. There's a guy in there, drowning. A double-decker bus. Dir dirigible? Dirigible? Is that what it's called? Yeah. And then a... Oh, look. We found him. And then a deer. And then a... Oh, what's the word for camel? There's a D sound. And then a... Some kind of dinosaur. A destroyer. Another kind of dinosaur. I don't know what that is. Oh, man, I don't know some of these words. There's an eagle. Or dove? Maybe no, a dove. A doorknob. Boy, this is a real test of of somebody's English, isn't it? Well, there's more stuff down here. Deuteronomy. And, who's a, what is that, an author, I think. And then Diary. Wow. Oh, there's more. Look at this, man. There's more stuff up here. There is a Dalmatian. There is a dagger. Uh, there's a... Oh, I don't know what that guy is. Who's that? A Mountie. It looks like a Canadian Mountie. Here's a dog. What's that? I don't know. Here's a diploma. Here's another diploma. Drummer boy. A duck or a decoy. A doctor. And there's a guy down here. Who's who's that guy with the raccoon hat? Boy, there's a lot of stuff in there. Gosh. Okay, let's move on. Alright. Eight enormous elephants expertly eating Easter eggs. Okay. So let's see. Look at all these E names. Elizabeth. Ernest. Eric. Edward. Emily. And Egbert. <laughs> nice names. These are elephants, okay. Then they've got chocolate eggs. And then they've got, what else? Here's an earring. There's not so many E words, it looks like. Maybe I'm not seeing them. What is this thing called? Is this like an Indian 
from India, this cap. I don't know what that's called. An E word. Eyeglasses, right? What else have we got here? What's this thing called? I, I don't know some of these words, actually. Oh, and then there's all sorts. Oh, man, there's all sorts. of. I'm not going to go through all these, but there's an easel. There's an 11. An emu. There's a... Echinda, an Eskimo, an Eagle. Oh, I see the boy right here. There's the boy behind behind this elephant, behind Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. All right. I think we'd good on ease. How about four fat frogs fishing for frightened fish? And here's a fish. And what do you see next to the fish? There he is again. He is on every page. So we missed him on one page. Hey, look. There's a Frankenstein's monster. There's a flamingo. A fishing pole. There's a frog, of course. What are these called? I don't know that kind of flower. Oh, flower. <laughs> That's what it is. Flowers. That's funny. There's a fox. What's this over here? Fet. Oh, it's a fet. Do you know what fet means? It's a French word. It means party. And then what is this bird up here? Uh, falcon? Maybe falcon, huh? Wow. It really tests out your vocabulary, doesn't it? Here's a fan. Another frog up here. Here's a flute. And what about this? You know what that is? That's a fairy. How about that? Fly? I want to give you a chance, too. Anything else? I think there's more, but I... I don't know. For... Ah! Forest! There's one. That's the big one. Alright, I think we're good on the F's. I wonder how long it took him to do this. Okay. Let's do one more, because I this is a long video. I didn't mean to make it so long, but I love it. Let's do let's do one more. Let's do gorillas uh, here. And then uh, maybe I'll make a part two as well. Alright, so this is check them out. You can already see the green and they're gorillas, right? And that's a gibbon, I think. Alright. Let's check it out. Great green gorillas growing grapes in a gorgeous glass greenhouse. Great green gorillas growing grapes in a gorgeous glass greenhouse. Okay, let's take a look. Gauge. Okay, I'm going to give you a chance. What's that? Guitar. What's that? Gibbon. What's that? A griffin, maybe? Yeah, I think it's a griffin. That's right. What's this? A gladiator. <laughs> Jeez. All right, what's that? A gong. All right, what else have we got here? Grapes. <laughs> a garter belt. What's this? A graph. What's that? Grasshopper. Glockenspiel. All right, what's this say? My grandma lived in Gooly something. Okay. And I don't see the boy in this one. Where's the boy? What's he wearing? Look. Gloves. Alright, I think we got almost everything. Uh, galoshes. I think a lot of these words, I think um, Graham is, is British, and I think a lot of these words are used more in British um, than in um, American English. Gremlin. Created by Roald Dahl, the character of the Gremlin. Here's a gerbil. In golf, in golf ball. Boy, all sorts of words, huh? Alright. This one's wearing glasses, isn't he? Oh my goodness, there's a goblet, there's grapes, there's a globe. There's a gnome, starts with a G. There's a gramophone. Boy, I'm testing my English here. Goat, goggles, goose, gate, guard, girl, or gal maybe, ghost. What's this, a shed of some kind? There's a giraffe. What's that? Ah, gecko, gargoyle. What's this? A goal. It's a goal, isn't it? Soccer goal. Oh, a gazebo? And what's this? Oh, I don't know. It's a mountain, but, but look who's close to it. There he is. There's the boy. You see him? Well, 
garbage can. Oh man, hey look, up here, a glider. Man alive. Okay, I think we're good on this page. Okay, I think I'm gonna end it there. Gosh, this was this was a lot of fun. Oh, I want to do this page too. All right, so we're on the letter H, but uh, yeah, I'll end it here. And uh, the next one is about these crazy boars, wildebeests, or something. Cool. Anyway, so I just read uh, A through G on this book called Animalia by Graham Base. I hope I'm saying his name right. Anyway, just a wonderful book. I I just loved it so much. I might do a um, I might do a part two as well, um, but I'm not sure yet. Let's see how you guys like this video. So anyway, thanks for watching and take care. Look around you for all sorts of lettered words. <laughs> bye bye.